Thank you for joining me for this week's Fairy Tale Fun Storytime program. The book that I'm going to be reading this week is called Rain Before Rainbows, and this was written by Smriti Prasadam Halls, and it was illustrated by David Litchfield. He drew the pictures and he did a really good job. I love the illustrations in this book, so I'm going to spend a little extra time on them so you can really pay attention to them. Here's the cover. And Rain Before Rainbows is a really beautiful story about this girl. She's our main character and her companion, Fox. And they go on this big journey together. So let's get started. Thank you to Candlewick Press for permission to read this book today, Rain Before Rainbows. Rain Before Rainbows, Clouds Before Sun. Night before daybreak, the old day is done. There are mountains for climbing, journeys to take. Do you see our girl and her fox climbing the mountain? Dreams that are hopeful decisions to make. There they are sleeping down there and dreaming. Dark days may shake us and worries creep in with dragons to duel and battles to win. Thunder will rumble, lightning will flash, the wind will start blowing, and tall waves will crash. But there are footsteps to follow and words that are wise. There's a map that will guide us when troubles arise. There are friends who will help us, courageous and kind, a rope to hold on to. And treasure to find. Sowing and planting, roots before shoot, stem before flower, leaf before fruit. Rain before rainbows, clouds before sun, night before daybreak, a new day's begun. A day full of promise, a day full of light, the morning's breaking. and the morning is bright. And that is the end. What a nice story that is. Rain before rainbows just means that even though things may seem bad or sad, like when it's raining, there's always something to look forward to afterwards, like the rainbow. Uh, so our girl and her fox, you know, went through that whole journey and it was really hard at times, right? But afterwards, they found that beautiful rainbow and they made all sorts of friends along the way too, right? So that is our story for this week. Now let's get started on our craft. So this is the craft that we're gonna be making this week. You've got your rainbow popsicle sticks coming out of your fluffy cloud with a cute sun poking out up there. Let me show you how to make it. Let's start with our rainbow popsicle sticks. And if you didn't know, the order that the rainbow goes in is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and then indigo, which if you've never heard that word before, it's the color that comes in between blue and purple. 
and violet, which is the word that they use for purple. So we've got all of our popsicle sticks here and then we're going to attach that to our cloud. So you are just going to put some glue right on the back of your cloud. Just like that. And attach it to the top of your popsicle sticks. Just like that. And then you can attach these cotton balls to make the cloud look all fluffy. And you can put them on just like this, or you can tear them up like this and glue them on to make your cloud look super fluffy like mine. Um, and then you've got your sun here. You can color this in any way you like. I put a little face on mine to make it cute. Here is a yellow one that I've colored in and you just glue this onto the back of your cloud to have that poking up at the top there and then you have your rainbow cloud and that is our craft for this week. Send me some pictures once you've finished. I would love to see it. Thank you friends for watching this story time today. You can check this book out from the library if you'd like to read it again or just look through the pictures. Uh, definitely think about it when things are maybe not so fun for you. There's always something to look forward to. I know that I'm going to be thinking about how brave this girl was any time that I need to feel brave too. Uh, and if you have any suggestions on books that you'd like me to read or crafts that you'd like to do, just send me a message. I would love to hear what you guys have to say. I will be seeing you guys next week. Bye. The rainbow goes in. Or, uh, that sounded weird. Is everything on? I'm all plugged in. Cool. Ooh. I'm gonna start over.